right, we are live, I think. Oh, yep, I see it. Um, awesome. Cool, all good on your end? We are live, I think. Yeah, oh, I'm okay. going to share it now. Okay. I think I did it. Okay. Awesome. Good work. Well, I will let you take it, take it from here. Where are we? Okay. Technical difficulties this morning. <laughs> um, so if you're catching this on Facebook, we realize now today there's passwords for Zoom. So I apologize in the emails. You didn't get that. Um, Going forward, we'll have it. And if you're watching live on Facebook, great. So we learned something new today. All right, so I hope everyone's been enjoying the weather today and this weekend, it's been great. Here we are again for another um, Monday with Dr. Jordan. And today, last week I shared with you, so every week if you're new to joining us, I share a little bit about Osteo Strong and what we do and how we help. And Jordan goes over some natural food tips, exercise tips, and, and anything that you guys can do to um, maximize your, your time at Osteo Strong, as well as things you can do outside of um, whatever, just to keep your bones healthy. So last week I went over some testimonials on how people uh, have greatly improved with the help of Osteo Strong. And today, in case you just don't know who we are yet or what we do, I'm just going to go over a little bit briefly on how we help and then pass it on over to Dr. Jordan, who's going to go over a new lesson. What is it? Santal, Live Longer. So she'll be going over that. So can't wait. So for those of you that are new to hearing about Osteo Strong, something that we do is we have these four machines and our overall goal is to help improve your bone density. Now, when we work to improve your bone density, we are also helping your posture, your balance, your alignment, and your overall well-being. And something right now in the time of COVID, everything that we have from Spectrum, which is what I'm going to talk about today, down to our modalities, things that I've gone over before, like the biocharger, PEMF mat, um, and our Norman Tech compression seed foods, everything combined help your immune system. So right now that's something that's very important to all of us. So we're strengthening your skeletal system and your immune system. Now, one way we do that, which is the big focus of OsteoStrong, otherwise known as Spectrum, which is four machines that we have that each target a different part of your body. So when you come in in as little as, you did it, Jordan, what, five to 10 minutes, you're going over these four uh, machines that each target a different part of your body. So you're targeting your whole body and that is enough for you to grow bone, improve your bone density, and as I mentioned last week, a lot of our members have seen improvements in their DEXA scans and just their balance and overall well-being. So our first one that we have is our upper growth trigger. And that one we are setting you up at 120 degree angle. And that is your strongest position where you can exert your maximum force for your upper body. So we're triggering everything from your shoulders down to your hands, down to your rib cage and we are helping you grow bone there. Now in our second machine is our lower growth trigger. That is targeting everything from your hips all the way down to the bottom of your feet. Again, we are setting your legs up in a 120 degree angle, which is again, your strongest position for your lower body as well. So after that, we have our third machine, which targets your core and that is again 
They are all biomechanically designed for increasing your optimal bone growth and muscle density. So your core is targeting everything from your rib cage and your deep abdominals, and you'll be pulling down, which is gonna cause a momentary muscle failure in your biceps. Then we have our last one, which is your postural growth trigger. And that is designed for optimal bone and muscle tissue in the spine, back, and forearms. So that one, we are really looking to make sure that you are standing nice and straight, nice and tall, you're perfectly aligned, and you'll be able to really focus on everything from the back of your neck down. So as I mentioned, in every machine, we're setting you up in your strongest position already. And we have a session coach with you to watch you, guide you, and help you every step of the way to make sure that you are doing everything properly. There will be no way for you to get any injury or anything, and we make sure that you are breathing along the way. So that is just a brief overview of what we offer at Adam Osteo Strong and how we help build your bone density. So if anybody wants to come in for a free consultation, if you want to try it out and see for yourself, it's we can definitely set that up online. You can put it in the comments. I know now we're in Facebook. And now I will pass it over to Dr. Jordan. Awesome, thank you. Hello, everybody. Well, you got to meet Dave, who's working on the HVAC at our office. Uh, I'm Dr. Jordan Leisure. I'm the owner and physician of North Shore Proactive Health, a state-of-the-art wellness clinic in the Northern Chicago suburbs. Again, Libertyville is a little bit north of, um, of you guys. Well, met. it's not too far of a drive. Uh, what we have covered is a lot of different techniques that you can utilize at home to help supplement the activities that you're doing daily at OsteoStrong. So some of the challenges you may feel, we hope that we are able to answer some of that and help you uh, utilize your time efficiently. Because like Demi said, you are literally spending, I don't even know, I, I went through it and I was like, wait, that's it. We're done. It's like three to five minutes. It is so super quick. Um, the machines are awesome. But as from a functional medicine standpoint, I like to see clients doing a little bit more on a daily basis. Your body was designed to move and your body was designed to be fed, to be fueled by healthy nutrition and also designed to have healthy thoughts. So that's what we're looking for um, you to be implementing at home. So what we're going to start covering as part of these weekly videos that Demi and I are doing is every other week, I'm going to be providing you with instructions from a program that I teach in the office called Stand Taller, Live Longer. So it has to do with the benefits of posture, how you're carrying yourself, really what is posture. That's what we talk about in this book. If you enjoy what I go through today, um, we offer individual sessions on this. And of course, um, a lot of what we have been doing these recent days is virtual sessions. So if you like um, just what we're doing right now, you don't even need to leave the comfort of your own home. If you have a physio ball, which I'll show you, they're the big athletic balls you can see behind me. Um, and you have a flat surface, you can essentially accomplish almost anything that we are going to do here today. These books are available. We do ship them. Um, they are $30, including shipping and handling. And we can send those out. I think I have four left in stock right now. Uh, so if you like this and you want to work at your own pace at home, if you want to learn a little bit more about, um, about what you're learning, then please feel free to hop in and um, utilize this. So we are going to get started right now. Let's see here. And I apologize. Obviously, I'm managing the video and um, some questions on Facebook. So if questions pop up, please feel free to message us. If you are watching a replay, you can reach out to Demi or myself. You know, you can always contact our office. It's info, I-N-F-O, at drleisure.com. And that's D-R-L-E-A-S-U-R-E.com. So if we can be of assistance, you can find me there. So let's go ahead and we are going to get started. So each of these programs is broken down into the why and then what they call a BAM philosophy. And BAM stands for balance, alignment, and movement. So everything I'm going to teach you today is going to fall into one of those categories. Each week is progressive, which means that it grows on the week before. And what we're going to cover 
today is going to be very simple. I want you to think of it almost like, um, like brushing your teeth. What activities do you do? We call this in our office spinal hygiene, which again, similar to your dental hygiene, you know, you're not going to get up and not brush your teeth. And you're, for most of us, you're not going to go to bed and not brush your teeth before going to bed. So start incorporating some of these uh, different exercises that you learn the same way that you would um, spinal, same way that you would dental hygiene. So the first one that I want to teach you is a balance activity and it's called stork. Now, ideally, if you are have not practiced balance and this is new to you and you're just starting out, I would request that you practice near a wall. So you're going to have your goal being standing away from a wall in the position I'm about to show you. And that is going to be for 30 seconds on each side. So we're going to stand up. We're going to do this 30 seconds on each side. And again, if you have not been routinely practicing this, you can do it by a wall. You can hand, hang on just to see how it feels to engage your core and do a little bit of this movement. And if you are used to this, if balance is old hat, if you're doing a lot of yoga, then let's take a look and see what that should look like for you. So stork, again, we want to have our legs hip width apart. We're gonna pick one up and you can see I'm at 90 degrees in my hip and I'm at 90 degrees in my knee. So I should be able to do this no problem and my arms can be however is comfortable for me. We could be doing different things, make it a little bit more challenging for 30 seconds on each side. And then when you're ready, you can relax, you can shake that off. And then we'll go ahead and do the other side. So same thing, we're gonna stabilize this leg. We're gonna pick up this leg. And again, I'm at 30, 90 degrees and 90 degrees. And I can do the same thing with my arms. Whatever feels best, I can, they can just hang out. And that's our practice. So again, if you're not comfortable, you can do this activity by a wall. You can hang on until you feel like you can get away from the wall and just use it for your touch point or use it for stability. So that is our first, that's our B for balance. So I would like to see you doing that twice a day Again, 30 seconds on each side is our goal. So overall, this really isn't gonna last you more than a minute, but try that two to three times daily, morning, noon, and night, or whatever works into your routine. The second one that we're gonna do is alignment. And this is where this physio ball comes in. Now, the ball that you should purchase is going to be based on your height. So please take a look. There's a few things that I always tell people when looking to purchase a physio ball. Um, and these days, please shop around because unfortunately, a lot of people have been increasing the price on workout equipment since people have been at home. Um, we have a few in stock. We have small, we have small sizes in stock that I know for sure. Obviously, they're right here. Um, this small size, it's going to be a 55 centimeter, and it's appropriate for an individual that is 5'1 to 5'6. So if you fall in that 5'1 to 5'6 range, getting a small physio ball or one that is 55 centimeters is going to be appropriate for you. Now, if you are taller than that, you know, you may need a medium if you're up to about six foot, and then maybe a large if you're six foot or taller. Again, um, the size is very important because it will change your alignment. It will change how you're sitting. So you'll notice here I am on a pretty big ball. So I'm 5'10". This comes up to about mid-thigh on me. And you do want to make sure that the ball is blown up with air so that it's pretty firm when you sit on it. The other thing that you want to watch for, especially if you have pets or young children around, is spending a couple extra bucks. And I can't remember what the term is. I don't see it on mine. Um, they are like pop proof 
or they are um, low flow, which means that if a kid, um, you know, goes to pop it, or if you have a dog or someone and they bite it, then it won't explode in their face. And that was very important to me because I have both a toddler and pets. So please be careful when you are shopping around, you know, the cheapest product is probably going to be a, a lower quality. So be careful with that. So the next two exercises are very similar. The A is gonna be for alignment. So we're working on how we're sitting. So our pelvis is very key here. So you wanna watch what's going on with the pelvis. Am I sitting like this? Am I dropped down? Am I pushed out too far? Or do I have a nice neutral pelvis? That's what you wanna work on at home. So this is our A in our BAM for alignment. And if you need a little bit more balance, if sitting on the physio ball is challenging, you can bring your feet out. If you like the challenge, you can bring your feet in close. You can pick one foot up and you can add a little bit of balance in there. You can see I'm shaking a little bit when I pick one foot up, I'm a little more unstable. Or I can just bring them down and maintain that alignment. So this is a great exercise. And this is one, if you're sitting, if you're working at home, watching TV, anything like that, you can utilize a physio ball to improve some of your stabilization. And that one we're just gonna do twice a day. So that's very easy. Our final exercise takes our sitting one step further. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna take that nice neutral posture. You'll notice I've got the 90 degree angle in my hips, 90 degree angle in my knees. And what we're gonna do is we're gonna do either the alphabet you can write your name. You can count to 10 with hip movements. So what do I mean by that is, if I'm gonna write my name, so I'm gonna do J, O, R, and this whole time I have a nice strong posture. D, A, and I'm doing capitals, N. Now it doesn't look like much, but it's great for the core stability and it's great for that balance. So that's where we're starting with our stand taller, live longer exercises. So again, usually when we teach this in the office, we do it every single week. So we're building on what you've learned the week before here with the Osteo Strong videos, we're gonna be doing them every two weeks. So we give you a little bit more time to practice. This should give you some time right now to purchase a ball if you don't have one. Again, if you have questions about that, about pricing, feel free to send me a message. Off the top of my head, I don't think that you should be paying more than, um, let's say like 25 to $30 for a ball. And you can use it for quite a variety of things. So if you saw the previous video that Demi and I did, we did some exercises, including the ball. You can do your weightlifting on the ball. You know, you can just utilize the ball for sitting, again, watching TV as you would a chair. You can also do quite a few core exercises with the ball. So watch that you're getting the right size um, and ideally a um, pop proof or a, a low flow ball would be my recommendation. So let's try that. Remember the balance is 30 seconds on each side once a day, or excuse me, three times a day, the sitting, working on that core. And again, shoulders should be relaxed when we're doing this. You shouldn't have to concentrate so much that the shoulders are up in the ears. So shoulders should be nice and relaxed. Heart to the sky, pelvis in a nice neutral position. That's our A for alignment. And then our M for movement is going to be, again, doing the alphabet, counting to 10, doing your name, whatever it may be. And you can keep this as stable as you can. Obviously, I'm trying to exaggerate so you can see there's movement, but keep this as stable as you can and just move the pelvis. You're almost doing a little dance there. So if there's questions, feel free as always to reach out. Um, these should be simple and you should be able to incorporate this into your daily activities. So we'll see. If we have any questions come up, then me, I don't know if you had any hey. questions on your side. 
Um, I've just been like trying to spread out the video. I'm really sorry, everybody, for our technical difficulties. <laughs> um, I was answering an email and making sure that it was on our Facebook page. So now we know what happened. Next week, this will be smooth. <laughs> exactly. So I don't, I didn't see anything on our Facebook pages so far. I have it in our group and our public page. So yes, I guess if you guys are seeing this later, if you have any questions, just put it in the comment box and Jordan or I will try to keep up with that. Absolutely. Yeah, and the key, the reason that, um, part of the reason that I thought that this would be nice to incorporate some of these postural activities is because there's much more to posture than just how you're sitting. So for us, again, from a functional medicine standpoint, we want to, yeah, did you do a little, <laughs> sit up a little straighter? Um, your, your posture will have a big impact on your ability to take deep breaths. It can impact your digestion as well. Um, so we want to make sure that your cardiovascular health is functioning as well as it can, as well as your digestion. So that's part of the reason that having that open heart, having shoulders nice and rolled back, you know, for a lot of us, we have a tendency to do this and it happens so slowly over time, we don't even realize. So we spend a lot of time, you know, on the phone or driving, or maybe in our job, we did things. If you're sewing, you know, a lot of things in our society are very anterior work. So we need to make sure that we're relaxed and we're back. And this helps um, helps in a very easy, non-committal, you know, almost no com no equipment way to, to help to improve and strengthen bone health at home, in addition to obviously the programs that they're doing in-house. Yeah, that's why I like these doing these with you because you are helping let all of our members know and other people that what they need to also do outside of us because we're not the end all be all you guys have to do extra things too <laughs> it's a great it's a great piece to the puzzle and that's you know i was i was thinking about that um last night i was getting into my car and i was you know we had done a complete a full day of no technology for my toddler which i was very proud of um and i was like you know people think that it's so hard to be healthy it takes so much time to be healthy but all we need to do is a slight pivot on what we view as, as normal activities. And so a lot of people are spending a considerable number of hours, you know, working on the computer, but it's not really work. You know, a lot of social media, a lot of shopping, a lot of other stuff. Um, we spend a lot of time watching TV. So if we could just take, you know, I recommended this morning, take 15 minutes from that and dedicate it to yourself. And that may be for some people, meal planning, it may be for some people, these postural activities, you know, maybe obviously a visit to you guys, they could do like three visits in the 15 minutes. So, you know, that makes a considerable improvement in their health without, you know, feeling like they're neglecting other areas of their life. Right. All about our priorities and what's important to us. Exactly. All right. Well, I don't see any questions. So again, drop them in the Facebook group and next week we will not have any hiccups. <laughs> we will be smooth sailing. Yes. All right. Well, thanks Jordan. And we'll see you all next Monday. Absolutely. Thank you guys for tuning in. Bye. Bye. -bye.